Hi everyone, I'm Kay Tool. Welcome to my channel. Living in an urban city, we can only go to parks and gardens to see some birds and flowers. The walk through aviary in the Hong Kong Park is a great place to observe birds up close. It is interesting that they build a place like a tropical rainforest and there are a wide variety of birds. It's a great place to get some inspirations. I'm going to start with the tree trunk using a large brush and just ink. And then dip a bit of ink to paint the second stroke to create the hole. It takes a bit of practice to get used to use the large brush because the brush belly contains a lot more water than a small brush. And then I'm switching to a small brush to paint the parrots. The parrots will be in green, which I use the blue and yellow to mix. And I touch it up with a bit of red at the tip for the hat and then paint the, the back. The beak is like a hook, which is different from a regular bird. And I'm going to paint the chest with yellow and a bit of orange instead of all green. And then I'm going to use ink and a small brush to paint the lower level of canopies. I am not painting a particular type of leaves or plants um, because it is a, an environment like in a real life. So it's like a tropical rainforest. There are a lot of different types of plants and mostly leaves anyway. So it really doesn't matter, but I'm painting them in clusters. In traditional freestyle Chinese painting, less is more. So we like white space. And when it comes to composition, it is very personal. So, and every artist has his or her own style. And um, it really is up to you, like how you would like to present your artwork and how you would like to paint and how much you want to paint. But for me, I'm happy with what it is right now, pretty much. So I'm not gonna add much to it. And I like the, um, texture of the tree trunk edices and I do not want to cover it. Now I'm getting some dark ink to paint the veins of the leaves. If you're new to my channel, I'll leave some descriptions of the materials that I used in this painting and all of my other paintings. So please check it out and hit the uh, subscription button if you are interested in seeing more of my demonstrations. I'm actually quite excited after my visit of the parks repeatedly because each time I, was, I see different things and get new inspirations on the subject and what you paint and the composition. As always, I will show you a close-up of this painting so that you can observe the details. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this. I'll see you in my next video.